We are machines that are built to worry. And so, you know, when challenges come up, it is very natural for us to convert our thinking powers into concern. And, you know, there's a beautiful Stanford research that said 82% of the things we worry about never happen. So we know all this, right? But, you know, we, we worry about all these things. We operate in this scarcity mindset, which then doesn't allow us to actually realize the, the resources that are available to us. It doesn't allow us to think more deeply in, you know, the situations that we're in. And so coming from this abundance mindset means that we open up our minds and what we know is that the only person we should be really comparing ourselves is to us yesterday, right? And so mm. that is a healthy comparison. The rest is unhealthy. Um, we can use potentially others as role models, you know, in, from a motivational perspective, but if we're actually comparing ourselves to them, we know psychologically it can be quite damaging. I think this is probably the most important thing to pin down as a leader. When you look at performance and how individuals perform and lead, intelligence, IQ accounts for about 7% of uplifting performance and capability. The components of mental toughness account for 27%. And when I saw that statistic, I thought to myself, why are we not talking about this more? This is obviously really important. 